talk good stewardship. If you were to go to a Christian financial seminar, you would probably hear something to the effect of, God wants you to take good care of his resources. He doesn't want you to waste his money. And he wants to make sure that you're being wise with his money so that it can grow. And if you can show God that you're good at investing money and making it grow, then God will entrust you with true riches. Ever heard that? But consider this, the disciples of Jesus Christ who, you know, left their family businesses and gave all their money away. The widow at Zarephath who gave her last bit of oil and flour to feed Elijah the prophet. Yeah, she didn't give him an application to decide whether or not he was worthy. And Jesus obviously either didn't do a background check on Judas, didn't know his background, or didn't care. The widow who gave her last mite. These people may not be considered financial gurus. They may not even be considered good stewards by many Christian financial counselors and pastors. But in God's book, they were considered faithful. How does God want you to handle your finances? Is it really more important to God that you're able to make your money grow? Or is it important to God that you're able to make your money go? Brothers and sisters, read the Bible and do what it says. Uh -huh.